there is an interesting update on the uh, LCON study. In the LCON study, uh, patients that were not transplant eligible were treated with Velcate, Melphalon, Prednisone, or with uh, Daratumumab, Velcate, Melphalon, Prednisone. And we knew already uh, from uh, last year's uh, presentations at ESCO, amongst others, that Dara VMP is better than VMP in terms of response and progression-free survival. And, in this in, and during this meeting, Professor San Miguel from uh, uh, Pamplona will also show a subgroup analysis in which he shows that also, also the patients with an age more than 75 years benefit from DARA plus VMP. So this regimen is also feasible in, uh, in old patients, which is important because when a regimen is too toxic, it's not feasible. So this updated analysis also shows the, uh, the feasibility of daratumumab, the well tolerability profile of daratumumab in this patient group. Another update at EHA will be on the uh, PAVO study in which uh, it is being presented in a poster presentation that uh, daratumumab can now also be given as a subcutaneous infusion during two or three minutes, which is much faster, of course, than um, uh, when it's given intravenously because that takes six hours, the first infusion, and then the second infusion, four hours, and then three hours and 15 minutes. So two or three minutes is much more convenient for the patients, also much more convenient for the daycare unit. So logistically speaking, it's much more appealing. It's not only faster subcutaneous administration, but it's also um, better tolerated because the, the infusion-related re infusion re reaction rate drops from 40% to 16% with an equal effectivity in this group of patients. And now the Columba study is starting to enroll patients in which there will be a head-to-head -head comparison of subcutaneous versus intravenous daratumumab to learn more about um, this type of administration. But I think this will be the future, that we give daratumumab via via, via rapid sub-Q administration, which is very which is much better uh, for the patients and for us as a hospital.